A while ago, I looked at the first single for all of the current subunits. While the start isn't going to necessarily determine which group is the best in the end, it does establish the style of the group and it helps build the fandom for the group. If you wish to see my results, visit the link in the description, otherwise it's time to go over the results of my poll. This is the poll in question. I asked you guys to rank the subunits 1 through 9, where 9 is your least favorite. This is not asking what your favorite or least favorite group is, but rather how you felt about the first single only. Each group had a single which had 2 songs in it, so that puts us at 18 songs total. The songs for each of the groups is BB had Diamond Princess No Yutsu and Love Novels, Lily White had Shida and I Love Oshiete Love and Anone Gambare, Pronton had Love Marginal and Sweet and Sweet Holiday, Azalea had Toki Meki Buni Gaku and Tori Koriko Please, Sharon had Genkai Zenkai Dei 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 and Yoza wa Nande Mo Shiteru no, Guilty Kiss had Strawberry Trapper and Guilty Night Guilty Kiss, Azuna had Dreamland Dreamworld and Cheer For You, Diver Diva had Supernova and Love Triangle, and Quartz had Sing and Smile and Beautiful Moonlight. Now with that out of the way, we can finally get to the results of the poll, and as a reminder, this is not my opinions, this is just an average of all of the people who participated in the poll. So without further ado, let's get to the results. So Asuna gets 9th place and that's very much expected and we have Guilty Kiss winning this poll which is also pretty much expected. You know BB did a bit worse than I expected in this poll and we had Quartz doing pretty well. And I should also mention Diver Diva did pretty well and I'm also glad to see Lily White doing pretty well as well. I of course overrated Azalea the most but that is my favorite group so yes I am a little biased there. So it's understandable why there's such a difference between how I rated and you guys rated it. Now if you're also curious, I also averaged these subunits to get a look at the groups as a whole. So if we look at it, Aqua subunits did the best overall for the first single. And Mew and Niji Gaku are a little bit behind. And now we're going to take a look at the demographics to get a little interesting view on some of the viewers. So this is just people indicated on what country, age, and gender they are. So I can get an idea of each one. On the top, I went and grabbed the major groups and got the averages for each subunit. Gold is first overall, our silver is going to be second, bronze is going to be third, and red is in the worst for that category. And then the best section for each subunit, I will bold that so you can quickly see where they shine the most. Again, keep in mind that this is just the first single only. This is not necessarily how people feel about each subunit. So if we take a look at Asuna, for example, here, of course, no surprise here, it's pretty much the worst in almost every section, except Asia. So Asians actually tend to like Asuna more than other countries. And Asuna struggles the most for US females. Azalea does better with older viewers, though. It did get third for European and Asians, which does help it out a bit. The worst section for it is US males, which I guess that includes me, but I guess overall, not as popular with US males, which is kind of odd since males in general tend to like it more than females. For BB, BB shines the brightest with the 10 to 14 year olds, but they tend to struggle with Asians, older views, and males in general. Again, this is for the first single. Shannon does best with Asians, but it struggles with older and anyone who's not in the 15 to 20. Shannon does the best with Asians, but it struggles with anyone not in the main demographic, which is 15 to 20 year olds. So that's why it tends to be a bit lower. Males and Europeans are also not that fond of this group as well. Diver Diva does pretty well overall. US females seem to like them the most. Though the younger and older viewers, not so much of a fan of it, but the core demographic is within a 15 to 20 year old, so that's why it does pretty well. Europeans also tend to like Diver Diva more than the rest. 
Guilty Kiss sweeps every section as they are the clear favorite and they came out pretty strong with the first single. They are d adored by US males and Guilty Kiss, while doing very well in middle sections, if you had to pick a section where they struggle a little bit, it's with the younger audience. Lily White shows up pretty well here. They got two seconds and a third overall. Their best section is for the younger audience and females tend to like Lily White while males are not as fond of that group. Asians didn't like this group's first single as much though. For Ponton, their best section is with the older audience. They were least liked by Asians and they also tend to struggle a lot in the US. For Quartz, they did pretty well overall. Males really like their first single, but females less so. The older audience tends to like them more and they overall did pretty well. So what do you guys think of the results? you guys agree? As always, here are all the voters I wish to be credited. Here are also some of the comments by the voters. I'm honestly not that surprised by the results. They are more or less what I imagine would line up with the general opinion of groups. I have asked people what people like or what their favorite groups were and it's, it kind of does line up. A lot of the cutesy groups tend to struggle a lot more and we have groups like Guilty Kiss who are just clear favorites all the time. And the David Eve seems to be pretty much going towards that direction as well. So that's kind of what I expected. I know Zelia has generally been the second best in Aqua, and it's still true here. But maybe there are some other singles in the future that will combat this narrative. Let me know what is your favorite best first single, and why is that? You got a favorite song in one of these singles? Let me know. Should someone give the first single as a listen to? Why is that? Let me know in the comments below and maybe you can convince other people otherwise. Now I can't wait until this video gets outdated when Alayla probably inevitably gets a subunit. Thank you guys for watching and I hope to catch you guys in another video soon.